you can visualize, it's a tiger box. Oh, okay. So this is your corn. The thumbs are up. The two index fingers are facing each other. After time, one of them will sink or slope on your wrist, and that's natural. If you feel, okay, and more or less, you feel very open here, but all your shoulders are relaxed. And you try to breathe low, your head is straight. Breathe deeply. You really relax your shoulders, your elbows, and your wrists. That's why a lot of times you'll see ill trembling. Today I'm trembling a little bit, I'm amazed. All right. Uh, all these are just natural reactions. And we'll do around four more breaths. Okay, our next one we'll just, remember we'll just do it, our palms are on top. But now it's just deep breathing, and we relax everything. More or less, we want to feel this relaxation through our mind. And then, oh, I actually should start from the head. Okay. What we want to do is relax all our facial muscles. I read a couple of days ago, there's 42 muscles. Mm -hmm. So if you can do at least four or five. <laughs> Like, actually, I can do this one. I can do this one. I can do the jawline. My jawline, maybe because we're guys or something. I mean, I'm, I'm a guy. Okay, screw that one up. Uh, I find I have a lot of tension. I'm, I'm, I guess I'm always, but I don't even realize I'm doing that. So you relax right up here, the muscles, you know, and around the eyes, and then the forehead. Those are the ones I'm good at. Okay, so try relaxing there. Then you relax your shoulders and actually you feel them just sinking down. And as they sink down, they sink down into your elbows. And from your elbows, see the, the wrists are around here. This is a natural rounded position on your knees. So they're relaxed, that all the fingers are relaxed. Okay, so now we'll breathe, keeping all those in mind. muscles, our shoulders, our elbows, our wrists, but they're kept out straight here and it's almost like if you're pushing but you don't. You like out here and then just stop and just have that relaxed feeling. Everything's sinking down. And then we'll breathe five breaths. outside and there's a very okay in, in Spanish we call it uh, uh, cat whiskers okay they're they're when the rain when you have the very light rain all right in Spanish is uh, okay they got them but anyway the thing is I don't know what it is in English I'm, I'm born and raised here but anyway it's a real thin mist, mist misty rain what no, no, it was very light rain. Uh, mist. Yeah. mist, okay, like a misty rain. I mean, that's the word. That's how you should feel. All right, you've got the, the tingling, but a lot of times your whole body will just feel that way, okay? 
and this is a good thing. I mean, don't, ah, something's wrong with me. You know what I mean? The first time, because my teacher didn't tell me at the beginning, I'm like, oh, you know, of course I was younger and stupider too. No, I'm still stupid, but I'm older. But anyway, the thing is, is it, you feel this light feeling and it's, once you, once you get it a couple of times, you enjoy it, it's enjoyable. The first time you're like, you know, it sort of shocks you and then it disappears. As soon as you think about it, it disappears. So it's very interesting. Okay. All right. All right. Let's do, uh, let's do some work. Now we have a little play and we'll do some work. Okay. And we're going to go what we did last time and we're going to, uh, emphasize another point. And these are for balance, okay? And uh, again, I'll show you, I'll show you uh, forward and sideways, okay? And more or less, we'll start from, just so I show you first, let's follow, okay? We open and close, we open up, push, come back, and then we circle, circle, come down, and Remember that? No? I remember doing it. Okay. I don't remember it. Okay. <laughs> That's a good answer. <laughs> you know? Okay. I'll do it again and I'll do it sideways. Okay? Because you know the first part. When we go open, close, and brush knee. That you know. You come back, play the lute. Okay, now, everyone know knows that. From here, we circle the left, circle the right, over our head, right. You did the first one, okay. okay. Okay, oh, I know what I can do. Okay, we're gonna go in stages, all right? Because, it, okay, just stand straight. And what we're gonna do, okay, bring our left hand out and circle, make a circle. I mean, this kind of way, okay? Clockwise. All right, now we'll add the counterclockwise circle. Can we do that? No, we can't do that, okay. <laughs> That's okay. All right, here. See, when one comes out, the other one goes in, okay? Circle. And it comes down. Just sort of, as soon as it comes down to the waist, yeah, you're getting it. And it comes down to the waist, see? Circle. So all you have to remember, clockwise, counterclockwise. Clockwise, counterclockwise. Good. I saw you doing it. You're okay. All right. From there, we're going to add on. Okay. So we're facing, facing the windows. We're at play the lute. Okay. So now we do the same thing. Bringing the left hand down. Circle once with the left. Bring up the right. But this time we bring it up to our forehead. Okay. And then we keep circling. Circle to the right. The right hand comes up to our forehead, and then we switch. Okay. Okay. See how we're doing off my neck. Okay. Just keep going. Okay. There. You're skidding. You're, you're skidding it along. Okay. Think of something. Okay. Bill, just let me have your hand here. Okay. Just, just like this. See? Just, and then bring out the other hand. It's just here. Just feel like something. You're just circling, like this, eh? circling. Okay, I right, slow, slow. We gotta go slow. Slow. Yeah. That's all we're doing, see? There you go. Okay. Play the loop. Right in front, just goes down. The other hand just goes down with it. Okay, and back up. Okay. See how I did that? We did three. One, two, and then we come to the third one. This one lifts up above our forehead and just comes straight down. 
okay? And just go as far as you can go as, as, uh, okay, as your back has to be straight. You don't want it to uh, roll around like this. Keep the back straight as you go down. Yeah, but you have to stick out your foot. <laughs> I don't know a better word for yeah, that's it. Stick out your buttons or help me. <laughs> no, no, okay. Tush. Tush. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay. So if, if the thing is, is this will come out a little bit, okay? But not, I mean, you don't want to really stay out there. You want to sink and then it comes out very at the end right here, then it comes out a little bit. Okay? If you can't go that far, just go as far as you can go. Don't, oh, okay, and don't overdo it. Okay, the goal, maybe Bill, because he does yoga and everything, the thing is to go all the way down to your, um, your laces, okay? It's pretty far down there. Yeah, straight ahead. And this one stays, see this one stays, this one stays here. Keep it straight. You have your knees bent? Yes, oh, you have to bend. Oh, okay, all right. You have to bend the knee. And then this one sinks. It's a little hard to do. That's why the butt sticks out, all right? Because if you, if you do it straight, then you have a lot of pressure on this leg, okay? So that's why your butt comes out. If you want to do it straight, that's okay. But you won't go too far. Because you go here, you're putting all the pressure on this left left leg, which is good to build you up, but it hurts. <laughs> you don't want to hurt that much. Okay, up here. And this one is light. Your lead leg is light. You have the wrong foot. The wrong foot. Yeah. And you can do it that way too. Certain people cannot balance themselves, so you can leave it flat, but try to put no weight on it. You go here. See, but there's no, there's almost no weight on it. Yeah, if you're feeling in, uh, uh, com uncomfortable, it can be flat, but try to keep all the weight off of it. Good? Oh God, that one last one killed me. Buddy, <laughs> back. <laughs> okay, no problem. Any questions? Okay, let's go from the beginning. It is getting hot in here, isn't it? Yeah, but okay. If, if, as long as no one bothers them, because... Is that okay to open the window over my door? No. I'm morose, of course. <laughs> okay, anyway. We go, we start off with the brush knee, so we try to keep it all together. Open, close, energy ball, extend out, brush knee, come back, play the lute. Now we're gonna go circling. But then, okay, we're gonna do three circles just to get the motion. But normally it's only one, okay? On the third one, the right hand comes above and then we just sink down. Okay, come up and press with your left. The right hand actually protects your, your forehead and the other one just extends. You do not have to go forward or anything, just open up. This is called a energy through the back. I forgot exactly his name. Or a fan through the back. So actually the energy comes up your leg and comes out your hand. All right? Feet so still are in the same position. Still in the same position. Okay, let's see. Come up. Yeah, no, it, it, it's circle. Okay. Okay. It's already circular. The hand, the left hand, when it comes down, it should be circular. It comes up, it's just like this. Yeah. With the any finger up that left one. Up. Okay? There we go. Okay, you take. Okay, and you. You're like this, like, hi. You know, see? Protecting yourself. Okay? So you're around it. Okay, relax for a second. This is a relaxed position, all right? And it's all circular. This hand should be circular. This hand should be circular. They should not be squared off, okay? If it's like this, all right, or way like this, that's no good. We want to have both the hands in a circular fashion. Okay, a little bit more circular with your elbow. See, the elbow is not, a, we don't want to have a, a hard angle. We want to have a soft angle, okay? 
Hey, this, the, okay. Any questions? Whew. talks about the stepping and this is also play the lute okay that we do here and then we go step 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 and here and actually they made an emphasis uh, that it's really good for your balance in stepping because you're you're in awkward position almost like falling but you keep yourself upright so the thing is is it's like turn here all right we turn here see we're like and then we step forward. But the footstep. So right? So we're here. Okay? From here. It turn this way and we extend. See, we're using hands and feet. And then we step. Alright? And then step again. Okay? So they're uh, they were talking in this article that this is really good for your balance because you're off you're training yourself to be. The thing is, is you're off balance, but balanced. You know, you're apparently off balance. You get, I, I understood. It's getting a feeling that you're uncomfortable, but you're rebalancing yourself. So it's a process, it's not just. Not yeah, it's a process, yeah. It's a process, because you, or what you want to do, it, you know, they were saying, very interesting, as you extend it, you're always, Okay, what you want to do is get a little bit more imbalance. And make it balance. Get a little bit more imbalance. So you kind of push your edge of balance. I never thought about that. I just like <coughs> I go, oh this is interesting. I think it's good. You know? Just because I didn't think of it doesn't mean, you know. Okay, so we're gonna do that a little bit, okay? And so we'll be facing the windows. And we'll have play the lute. Alright? We turn the left, extend the right. Take a step, uh, rotate the hands, now extend up the left, and the right comes back, and we take another step forward, we double punch, and punch, okay? We're not gonna do the, the apparently step back yet. We just try to get those three done first. What is this hand doing when this is punching? This is just the fist. Okay, play the lute, take a step, push with the right. Take another step, rotate, push with the left. Take another step, double grab, punch. Okay, back. Okay. Okay, play the lute. Okay, take a step, push with the right. And then take a step forward with the right. Rotate, extend the left. Take another step, double grab, punch. All right. All right. You're too far. You're too close. Unless you feel comfortable. Okay. Let's see how you guys do it. Okay. Play the lute. Okay. Turn. Oh. Turn the left. It won't let me sit there. Okay. Step forward. Do the right. Take another step forward. We got the footwork. Okay. There. I punch. 
right to serve. Well, it comes up behind. You you know you don't want to go forward. Okay. You switch. I saw you. Okay. Let's go again. All right. Let's see how you do it. Okay. Very good. Play the lute. Okay. Take a step with the left. Push with the right. Okay. Okay. Oh no, you just turn 45. Okay, from here, what we're going to do from here. See, you're this way. Just turn it this way, 45. Just out. Okay? And then the next step, like this, 45. Okay? And then the next step is forward. And then we punch at the same time. You know, the punch and the foot goes at the same time. Okay? Okay, go back. Okay, we're from here. Play the lute. Turn the left. Extend the right. Take a step forward. Extend the left. Take a step forward. Double grab and punch. Okay. All right. Try again. Any questions? Okay. It's actually this is actually good for your. Hey, bell. All right. Ready? Play the lute. Okay, first turn the left foot and extend out the right. Take a step with the right, extend the left. Step forward with the left, double punch. Uh, you, have the, you have the wrong foot, forward now, arm. Okay, there you go. Now I got Let's go back again. All right. Maybe we should just do the footwork. What do you think? I think you're, you get the, the hands get all confused. Okay. Do you want me to break it down even more? Or? No. No, it's okay. No. Oh, no? Okay. Here we go again. Okay. Let's go. All right. Play the loop. Turn the left. Extend out the right. Okay. Take a step with the right. Extend the left. Take another step forward with the left. Then we just double grab, punch. Okay, now one thing I forgot to tell you. When you have the left hand extended, all right, all you have to do is just turn it, flip it, and punch. Okay, once you step forward, because see, you have the first one, which is right extended, left extended. That left hand is already there. You leave the left hand there as you step. So you just double grab, punch. Left hand is always at the end, stays up, and so you don't have to worry about it. It already leads you your way. Okay, let's back up a little bit. All right. Ready? Play the lute. And we're on the tiptoes. No, this this is on the, on the, yeah. And so all you do is turn this way. Yeah, there you go. All right. First, turn the left, extend the right. Take a step with the right, extend the left. Take a step forward. No, don't switch. That's how you messed up. Okay? Once you have the left hand out there, just keep it there because it just, it just comes down. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Okay, back again. Okay. Play the loop. Take a step with the left, extend the right. Take a step with the right, extend the left. Do not move right here, from here. Just take a step forward, double grab, punch. Okay, does that make it a little bit better? Let's go. <coughs> I like it when it's high, it's more comfortable. Anyway, okay, ready, play the loop. Okay, turn the left, extend the right hand. You have to turn the, the left foot up, no. Okay, take a step forward, put the right, extend the left. Okay, take a step forward, now don't change anything. Just step forward and then double grab. Double grab and, and then step forward. All the way. It's a full step, it's the only one with a few one actually, a little bit more forward. All forward, yeah. 
There you go. Good. Good. Okay. Back again. Oh, we got it. Okay. Lay the loop. Okay. Turn the left. Extend the right hand. So when you, do you shift your weight forward or do you stay back? You stay back. Okay. And okay. then you shift. Okay. See, okay. That's a good question. Okay. If you put your weight too forward, forward at the very beginning, you're in trouble. Okay. So when you're here, it's just turn like this. See, all I do is turn. And then as I go forward, there's a slight switch, but still, okay. Then there's a little bit more weight on this foot. Okay. But over here, the first move, this first movement, there's no weight on it. Very little weight. And then we have here, then you put the weight. Then there's more weight. Okay. All right. And then you, as you step forward, okay, you shift. And then this one, the back foot lifts slightly. Can, can lift. You can keep it flat too. Okay. And then this one is easy. Just do the double grab and punch. But the first one is turn here, take a step, take another step. Punch. Okay? The slower you go, the harder it gets. Because when you do it slow, from here, which we're not doing, it's here. Take a step. No, we're not doing that yet. But anyway, I did it. Okay? Do you see how the feeling is like this? It's just a turn. Okay? But there's no weight. The weight is still back here. Okay? When we step, there's weight on it, but not that much as we step forward. The weight is still in the back. And as we just turn with the waist, then there's a little bit more weight on this leg. And then we step forward. Do you understand it? There's variations. That's why it's really good for balance. You're actually working on your balance a lot. Okay. Well, one more time, and then we have to do the whole set. that you're here. Okay. All right, ready? Play the loop. Okay. Left hand, left foot turns, right hand extends. Take a step. Switch. Take a step forward. No grab. Punch. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna have to blow my nose. Okay, excuse me. Stand back. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do it that way. Okay, then Bill, start doing the whole set. So I'll be right back, okay? Do you have any critics? Okay, All right, I'll be right back. Just, Bill, then just leave it for the set. Everyone's great. Relax. And hands up slow. Same. Step out to the left, to the left foot, push, and step in. Square, inhale, expand out, exhale, contract, and then we're gonna go, turn to the right, bend the hands out, look to the left, Let's try that again. So from here we go, turn to the right, step out to the right with the right, shift to the right, turn to the left. Okay, everybody got that? So from here we go, turn to the right, step out to the right, shift to the right, turn to the left. Feet flat on the floor. So we're looking to the left. Okay, so from here, then we go back. Form an L. We step to the right. Right hand comes up, left hand goes down. Uh, shift to the right. Left leg comes in, right hand goes down, left hand comes up. Right leg comes out. 
Left hand goes down, right hand comes up, shift to the right. And then left leg, was it? Okay, so then we go, left leg comes in, is that, is that it? No, it's all, okay, it's, all right. The stepping is always to the, to the right, is actually step, 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 step. Okay, so we always go right, okay, thanks. Okay. I'm going to tell you a couple, uh, one extra thing. If you guys can do it, if you can't, that's fine. We've been doing it just at, when we do an L, okay? We extend out, and then we come back and we form an L, and then we exchange hands, and then we step, right? Okay? If you can do it, the real way of doing it, okay, is from here, is just to come back, tap, and then go back out, okay? It's just here and back out. Okay? It's almost like a dance step that you know you come up and then back out. Come in and back out. Most people cannot do it. So when Paul Lamb was teaching it, he would tell people when you get better, put it together. If you look at most of the videos on Paul Lamb on YouTube, they've never done that. Every single one. Alright? So if you guys can do it, you want to do is once you have the extension, <coughs> you come back and come back out again. <coughs> See if you can do it. Thanks for coming. Thanks for doing this for us. See you next week. Yeah. Thanks, everybody. Bye bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. bye then. Okay. So we'll try to add that on. Is there any questions before that? Let's, okay, let's go. Okay, from the very beginning. And we'll go slow first time. We'll go medium and then we'll go a little bit faster. Okay? See so if we can get a bunch in. Okay, ready? Begin. Up. Sink. Take a step. Push. Take a step forward, push with the left, take a step forward, double grab, hunt, come back, a parent close, up, up, yeah, take a step forward, push, come back, open, close, energy ball, left over right, open up, push towards the door, come back, and step forward, and push, come back, Turn the wrist and push forward. Two feet together on eating. Ready? Step back. Open. Close. Step out. Come back. Click. I'll do the Trinity. Step forward. Come back. This time we're only going to do three. Take a step to the windows. Turn. Brush knee to the chalkboard, and then take a step towards the windows. Left comes over, come back, push, come back, push again with the left. Come back, open, and close. One more, and then uh, we'll do our cool down, okay? So let's try to get it, I'll go, I'll go a little slower. I'm not going to do any verbal commands. We're just going to go through it, okay? Ready? Begin.
only going to do three this time. Once, brush knee, brush knee toward the chalkboard, and brush knee to the windows. Time. <coughs> 